Hello everyone, my name is Ron Z from Coaster and today we're taking a look at the brand new redesigned 2019 Volkswagen Jetta. Let's roll the clip. Welcome back everyone. I hope you all enjoyed the cinematics we did for the brand new redesigned 2019 Volkswagen Jetta. And today we're taking a closer look at some of the key features and highlights that I really enjoy in this car. I mean, look at it. Everything has been redesigned. Interior, exterior, comfort, technology, performance. I am just absolutely amazed on the craftsmanships on the brand new Volkswagen Jetta. Now this car is just shy of 30 grand with the top of the line options that you can get everything you want. I mean, look in the front, you can notice a pair of LED daytime running lights and LED headlamps with some details that resemble some of the Porsche headlights that I find in Porsches with some grooves over here, some patterns, really, really sexy, really, really modern. Looking down below, you can notice these grooves right here, brand new, very sporty, very, very athletic. Moving along the center of the front bumper, you can notice brand new grille lines that are done in both chrome and black. Again, very nice touch. Some of the holes or some of the safety sensors that in the previous years are all hidden behind the big Volkswagen badge over here. So you don't see any holes on the front bumper giving you that, again, clean look of the Volkswagen Jetta. What's on top of it and what's really aggressive is this sculpted hood. Look at how sharp and look at how rigid the lines are, giving you that statement on the road without screaming for it. Moving along the side of the vehicle, you can notice a set of gorgeous 17 inch directional alloy wheels. I mean, this is actually a hit or miss for some people. For me, these wheels are definitely a hit. I am absolutely in love with it. It completes the overall look. I mean, for some people, I can see why you don't like it, but for me, I am absolutely in love with the design of the wheels. Moving along the side of the vehicle, you're gonna notice the rigid lines that you, see, you found on the hood over here on the, on the door panels that finish and runs across the entirety and finishing off at the rear bumper. The reason why they have those rigid line is because they want to make the car more safe. But what do I mean by that? Over here, I have a business card. If I, upon impact, this can crumble very, very easily if it's shaped and have no rigid lines. But if I were to just add in a rigid line over here like this, and I can't really squeeze down anymore. So upon impact, the car will absorb more damage and keeping you as safe as possible. Finishing off the vehicle, moving into the rear bumper, you're gonna notice this gorgeous embedded spoiler over here into the trunk very similar to the audi a4 design athletic sportiness a sleek all at the same time of course the front has led daytime running lights or led headlamps the rear has a pair of led taillights as well opening the trunk you're going to find it is actually quite spacious but what's interesting about the trunk is actually a two push system what i mean by that is you open the trunk and you got to push it additionally for the trunk to lock. So in the event that you have strong winds or rough weather, the trunk is able to lock in place. So just remember, next time you open the brand new Jetta trunk, push it one more time for the trunk to lock. Very smart in my opinion. And finishing off the rear bumper, you can notice these two chrome exhaust finishers for display purposes only. The actual exhaust comes out from the left side and hides behind the exhaust node over here, but this is just to give the additional sporty look and accent look uh, to match the chrome as well from the front bumper. Now, let's take a look at one of the most exciting feature and that's what's underneath the hood. Very, very exciting technology, power and performance in the Jetta. What do we have here, guys? We have a turbocharged 1.4 liter, four cylinder engine give you 147 horsepower and 184 pound-feet of torque. The best 
in its class. You're not gonna find another sedan on the market in this class that will beat its torque. And finishing off, pairing that with a brand new eight-speed automatic transmission with start and stop. Now, Volkswagen claimed that start and stop is the most smoothest out of all the models in the Volkswagen, and we're gonna experience that in just a second on how the transmission feels, on how the start and stop goes, and how the overall feel of the car goes. Now, let's take a look at some of the key features and highlights that I really like on the interior of the Volkswagen Jetta. That can be pretty annoying at times. Okay, we're gonna talk about the seats before I get in. Of course, they are leather seats with white stitching, pretty cool, pretty modern. And what's new on the 2019 Jetta are these memory seats, which is never an option in the previous generations with eight-way power adjustable. Very cool and very convenient. After getting inside, looking to my right, I'm gonna notice the shift knob over here with the mode selection button that allows you to switch between eco, normal and sport mode to change up the transmission depending on how you want to drive your Volkswagen Jetta. Moving up uh, on top, you're going to see the auto start and stop function. For anyone that has no idea what start and stop is, is that every time this vehicle arrives at the stoplight, you apply your foot on the brake and it's at zero kilometers driving. The engine will actually shut off to be to save you more fuel if you're waiting in traffic, whatever, whatever. And as soon as you put your foot on the gas or the throttle, the engine will turn, turn back on right away and give you that seamless, smooth transition that you just saved just a couple fuel consumption. Moving up ahead, I'm gonna notice a dual zone climate control, heated seats, ventilated seats, pretty cool, but again, also pretty standard for today's technology. Uh, looking up ahead, you, I'm gonna see a brand new eight inch display screen, very, very nice, very, very modern. Of course, you have your navigation, backup camera, but I feel like the navigation saturation is very average, but what's really cool about it is that you can translate whatever you see here into the virtual cockpit right in front of you. It is a brand new 10 inch digital screen right in front of you that you can customize any information you want. Of course, you can cu customize the navigation and bam, look at that. It is so wide, it is so beautiful. I would much prefer to see it on the virtual cockpit than the center console and Typing the view button over here, you can see different uh, information over here, and bam, look at that. Uh, this digital subdometer and digital odometer. It looks so, so sexy. It's so modern, and I love it. I love it. I love it. The resolution is actually quite nice as well. And looking back, you're gonna see a leather wrapped steering wheel with the cruise control and Bluetooth options on both sides of the wheel. And you're gonna see the some of the safety buttons over here, your lane keep assist, blind spot monitoring, rear, rear cross traffic alert, front assist, et cetera, et cetera, to keep you as safe as possible on the road. What's really cool and completes the overall sounding of the Volkswagen Jetta are the Beats audio system. Very cool with a subwoofer in the back so you can you can have the sound that you want in a concert, listening to it as crisp as possible so it make your day-to-day -day driving a lot more enjoyable. To finish off the interior, you have a panoramic sunroof. That's what they claim. Although you may feel like this is a sunroof, but because it is actually larger than the average sunroof, it is now considered as a panoramic sunroof on the Volkswagen Jetta. And one last feature on the Volkswagen Jetta that's very unique to it, and only in the Volkswagen Jetta, are the ambient lighting feature. I'm gonna show you how that works. Go to menu, vehicle, settings, and hit ambient lighting. And there are 10 color for you to choose from. So whatever your mood is, you can set the color depending on how you feel at that particular day. And they will light up across underneath the panels over here, as well as underneath the center console over here, right in front of the shift knob as well. Very, very cool. Very, very little, little, little features here and there that, that completes the overall value of the Volkswagen Jetta. And that's why I feel like for a car that's just under 30 grand, 29 grand, it's absolutely incredible. And I think that you guys should definitely come in and experience this for yourself. But now, let's go for a quick drive. Signaling to my left, um, this car is not gonna let me in. Well, he better let me in. And we're gonna arrive at a uh, red light and we'll see how the start and stop really functions, uh, behaves in, uh, in, this, in this scenario and see whether or not Volkswagen Jetta actually claim is the best start and stop go technology in the Volkswagen Jetta across the entire Volkswagen. Like, I mean, 
I, I'm just absolutely in love with the center screen. I can't stop looking at it. I'm gonna change the view to show my subdometer and odometer, and we're about to see how smooth the start and stop go function is from stop to uh, to start. Steam wheel feels actually actually quite nice. Grips grips very nice as well. Of course, Volkswagen owns Porsche, and you know they share the similar design and concept uh, with each other as well. Pretty nice overall feeling. Seats feel feels quite nice as well. You know the ventilated seats works really great. Um, a lot quicker than I would expect with some of the other vehicles. You know it takes forever for the ventilated seats to come in and really feel something right. But this one actually actually feels a lot quicker than the average ones on the market. And let's see how smooth this is. Actually, it feels almost zero lag from the stop and go. Wow, I actually didn't feel anything at all with the technology in, in, in Able. So I think this is actually, I think this, this claim from Volkswagen might actually be, be true. Yeah, holy, holy crap, like is, ooh, so seamless. Braking is great, very, very controlled. You don't have a slip feeling with a brake. Wow, driving experience, nine out of 10. So I'm gonna turn in here, we're gonna get some fresh Popeyes, just because we're a little bit hungry <laughs> on the road. Of course, chicken always is the best solution for a hungry stomach. You getting tenders? You're getting tenders? You ever get the tenders? No, I'll get the chicken. Uh, like Can I get the uh, 35 buckets? So that's it for me today guys, I hope you all enjoyed the review and cinematic we did for the brand new 2019 Volkswagen Jetta and before I sign off, I'm going to leave you with one last interesting fact. So the 2019 Volkswagen Jetta is all produced and manufactured here in North America and you cannot get it in Europe. My name is Ron Z and I will see you on a brand new episode of Cold Start next Saturday. Oh, make sure to subscribe.